Hi guys. So, <clears throat> it has been a while again, a week, since I have put anything on my face, seriously. Because of the heat and everything, I was just not in the mood to be putting on makeup. Yes, I also leave a break for my face. It's not every day that I put makeup and uh, I'm fine with it. I go to work without it and uh, yeah. Bien caliente gayot. So, dia lang ane kita man makeup. So, anyways, um, I'm here again. Kita luse de Salina Samwanga. So, what I'm putting is I'm um, starting with the Glam Glow uh, Moisturizer. This is it. Glam Glow Moisturizer. So, I've been using it and it's actually um, good. So, mm. every time we start on makeup, we have to moisturize our face. Para our skin would uh, be prepared for this um, makeup we're going to be putting on. So, here we go. Hi. I don't want to talk about COVID actually because it is slowly starting to stress me out. This COVID thing. I don't know when it's going to end. Looks like it's not going to end uh, in the next um, few months or even next year. I think honestly it's just gonna be like the flu we'll always have we'll always have it so we just have to really be careful I have to say though people are not so stressed out anymore as it as um, when it first came out here in the United States you know but everybody's being careful um, still the six six uh, inches so no six meters um social distancing and then of course um with a mask hi so you guys what have been uh keeping you busy um well for me as you have been seeing i have been enjoying crafting again especially doing wreaths so now i'm into um doing flowers flower wreaths so i just started uh, i well i did the ponset yeah you guys saw that and people are asking for a youtube video on that let let me see because it takes a lot of um effort and a lot of uh preparations to do this thing so we'll see um I'm not gonna make any promises but uh, when I have the time to sit down and do a video of it I will and last night I was doing the sinias you know what a senior flower is I'll, I'll show it to you on my Facebook later so um, yeah after we put the moisturizer what am I gonna put see guys this from the mask has been getting better a lot better actually I try as much as possible to um, remove my mask every so often especially now that it's so hot so when you, it's our face is sweating and so it's really not so good but what can we do right we need to have our mask so I am just gonna uh, put a little bit of my LA girl I'll also put a little on my uh, under eye I didn't get to sleep well last night um, A message uh, woke me up and so I wasn't able to go back to sleep again so 
There we go. Just so James has been doing really well with the online classes. At least he he's doing it all by himself. And then when Pete comes home, he just, he just like, especially in the math subjects, he would just recheck and, and look if he did those things right. But I have to say he's really good in math. He's a slow subjects are um, English and reading. He hates to read. But I guess that's how boys are. Some boys are. They're good in math, but then um, not on certain subjects like reading. So guys, um, there we have it. I just put the LA Girl Pro Concealer in orange. And with my finger, I'm just like... And now I'm just letting it dry for a second before I put my primer so for my primer today I'd like to use the hourglass veil primer so been looking at this hourglass and uh, So I'm just going to be putting my primer all over my face. Especially on my T-zone. So that was our um, hourglass, hourglass veil, mineral primer, oil free, broad spectrum SPF 15. So we'll see what hourglass will be doing to our face. So. Okay. So after putting up our glass, so I would like to use my. I also got the hourglass um, veil fluid makeup. So it's um, a foundation. It says shake well and apply with an hourglass foundation brush or fingertips for best results. I think I'm gonna use my fingertips for this. Hi James, are you done? No. Oh. All right, so it says to shake it. I think it's a little bit too dark, but um, mm. no, it's actually not. Using my Kat Von D brush. Oh, actually, it's really not. Okay. 
putting it on so this um, veil fluid makeup is basically very light as if you don't have any so and guys like I always have been telling you don't forget to put it on your neck too okay your neck and if you have like a V cut like I do today don't forget to put it so it's not weird looking when you have foundation on your um, face and not and your neck is is a totally different color so I have learned this actually <laughs> very uh, fluidy trying to add more here on the cheneo akal imio the only thing i don't like with this is how it comes it's just it's just so ansina ba oh and it's so fluid that it just runs through see oh I don't like this wait 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 let me clean it I no care you call el batel ba ma ano so I added it on my face where I had that blemish I like it's good but it's very um, liquidy does it even say here and I am using number 3.5 in honey Okay, guys, so we're done with it, right? Okay, my curiosity on the hourglass is done. I have to say, I like it, I like the finish, it's very um, light and it's smooth. So, okay. What will I? So now, guys, I'm gonna start on my face. Woo! Using my hourglass as well. It's hourglass eyeshadow palette in graphic. There were uh, several. Um, shadow palette but I wanted to use the graphics so it comes in this very nice color um, holder eyeshadow holder and these are the colors so basic colors so using my crown brush it's this oval shadow. I am going to dip into the... Huh? There's no colors. How will I tell you? 
Okay, guys, I'm gonna go into this um, light creamy color and I will use it as my transition color. So I'm just going to put it all over my eyeshadow. All right. I mean, I'm going to put it all over my crease, not my eyeshadow. My eyeshadow is this. Oh my gosh. So using the brown on this palette, the brown, I'm with my uh, makeup gig uh, pencil brush. It says, I am just gonna go through the edges, the outer V of my eye, and slowly work towards my crease. So, after uh, doing that, I would like to use um, a little of the green, like the olive green here. This one just with my finger. And put it in the middle of my crease. Oh. It's really not... Um, okay. There you go, and there's a lot of fallouts, even though I was just using my fingers. So, putting my um, liner, I'm just going to use this dark black um, and use it as the liner. Okay, dark black. Okay, so putting the oh my gosh, right? So using my newfound tribe cosmetic, uh, it's uh. The Brilliant Eye Brightener. Love this. Love this even more than my MAC.
I'll put some on the sides here too to brighten my uh, inner outer V. So now I'm going to use the foundation. I'm just going to use my e.l.f. The e.l.f. 16 hour camo concealer. And this is in bright beige. My beauty blender moist beauty blender just blend it Just blending everything. All right. So now I'm going to do my eyebrows. All right. my eyebrows with uh, my very special um, Anastasia Beverly Hills Just following my eyebrow line. Today I'm going to um, use this Global Glow Mineralize Skin Finish just to powder my face. Okay. I had this for quite a while now. But just with all the makeup, um, we have <laughs> just never um, used it so today I'm just gonna use it 
just to put it over my full face just to hold the liquid foundations and everything that I put in my eyes so there you go and what am I gonna use to maybe I'll use this uh, give me sun give me sun also mineralized skin finish but this one I'm gonna um, use more and I'm gonna use this today as my foundation uh, uh, blusher So it's getting there and today I am very very lazy I don't want to wear um, falsies so I'm just gonna use my liquid lash extension from Tribe Cosmetics I used this the other day and I have to say it didn't disappoint me. guess I just need to put on some so using this Maybelline lifter lifter gloss it's one of my favorites right now um, drugstore product but it's really good and what color is this amber so let's try amber So guys, I'm done. It can just be like a regular um, look, makeup look, wherein you can just go to the store or... So now let me do my hair. I still think what I want to do with my hair. Alright, I'll be back. Alright guys, this is my finished look for today. So what I did was I just put on a ponytail all of my hair up and then I had this uh, it's basically like a scrunchie only you I put it over my hair and this is the look mm. good thing I saw it uh, the lip gloss went into my Ah. <laughs> all right guys so this is it 
this is the look so see how easy it was and quick all right so i'll see you guys next time all right mm -hmm. love and kisses to all of you in Sambuanga. miss you guys bye